It's more than just an Olympic torch. It is the triumph over death, war, and indifference. Ibrahim al-Hussein received and carried this torch while passing through the Illinois refugee camp near Athens. Big honor, big honor. This isn't a game to me. It's an honor. This wasn't easy. Inside my heart, I feel so happy, so happy. Today I made it. What more can I say? I don't know. It was a symbolic gesture of hope for thousands of people who, like him, have fled violence and war, leaving behind their loved ones and their homes. I hope all refugees, not just from Syria, but from Iraq, Afghanistan, from Syria, that come to Europe who are athletes before, that they will join another sport team wherever they are. Hopefully, I hope that they don't just sit inside the camp. Ibrahim was a water polo player in Syria. He began swimming as a child and was encouraged by his father. However, his career came to a halt when he lost his leg in a bomb explosion in 2011. He made the best of his situation and is now a part of a wheelchair basketball team. He fled his city, Dir Sahur, one of the most affected by the war, and has been living in Greece for two years. He arrived there, like so many of his compatriots, on an inflatable boat. He now has refugee status and works in a cafeteria. Since he was a child, his dream was to participate in the Olympics. Although the war has taken everything from him, this dream could still come true.